And we have to be done at 11.30, so what do you say we squeeze in 15 more minutes? You guys up for that, right? I think so. Because I gotta tell you, this is one of the greatest nights of my life. I don't know about you. This is like rock and roll history going on on this stage, and I am so honored and so grateful for all of you for coming out, and for all of these amazing artists for coming out and playing for us tonight. It's simply surreal, so thank you all. All right, so, when I started in radio back in uh, 83, which is what we're celebrating, I, um, there was a band that I saw at an amusement park in New Jersey, where I'm from, that was called Great Adventure, and they were, they were playing on their first album, an album called Dawn Patrol, and um, I remember hearing a song called Don't Tell Me You Love Me, and it totally blew my mind. I was just out of high school, and here was this great dual guitar band with this little guy bouncing around playing bass and singing lead vocals. And that band, of course, was Night Ranger. Now, let me tell you guys real quickly. Uh, Jack Blades of Night Ranger and Kelly Kagey totally planned to be here tonight, but they weren't feeling well, and they were not able to travel, so... They couldn't make it, but from Night Ranger, it's the king of the whammy bar, and a, a good friend, and a phenomenal guitar player who also, of course, played with Ozzy on the Speak of the Devil album. Give it up for Mr. Brad Gillis over here, ladies and gentlemen. Love this guy, and love his playing, and always did. And um, he's going to do a Night Ranger classic for you. And if we have time, we're going to end with one last jam before we call it. We got Zach Throne over here on guitar. And now we can afford David Ellison. You know David from Megadeth? David Ellison, ladies and gentlemen, on the bass. From Warrants, my old friend Robert Mason is going to sing for you. And Glenn Sobel back here killing it on the drums. So, we got some time left. We're gonna let Brad do his thing. Are you ready for some Night Ranger? Let's do it, don't tell me you love me, rock it.
Alright. Tired yet? For Eddie! There you go. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, give Bradley a second. <laughs> you're right out there, I worry when you're so damn quiet. Why are you so quiet?
Mr. Brad Ladies and gentlemen, can we hear it from Mr. Brad Gillis? Robert Mason, Zach Throne, Glenn Sobel, David Ellison. Uh, so, Tyson Leslie with the coolest pants in the venue. Look at those pants Tyson's wearing back there on the keyboards. Right out of 1988. So according to the clock, it's 1127 and we gotta stop. Unless somebody's got 15 grand that they want to put into the overtime. Chuck, you already spent money. <laughs> what? Oh, hold on a minute. Yeah, we're done. We're done. That was three and a half hours of music. Come on now. Yeah, we got to call it. So, so I, I wouldn't even know where to begin, but this was a night that I will never forget. And I want to thank every single musician who was on this stage tonight. And I want to thank my friend Mike Portnoy, who's back here. Mike, come on out. Take a quick bow, sit. Mike, come on out, brother. Give it up for Mike. Brent Woods, come out here, man. Ace Freely. Whoever's in the wings of the stage, just come out and take a bow, man. Everybody, Chuck, get out of here. Everybody, come on out. Whoever wants to come out who's in the wings of the stage, come take a bow. We got two minutes before we gotta get out of here. Hal Sparks is here. Hal, come take a bow. Everybody. This was an amazing team effort. Brent and uh, Scotty Ludwig, Doug Burgess, Portnoy, everybody who helped coordinate this. And, um, you know, who, I mean, there's so many people I couldn't begin to thank. Thank you, everybody, for...